Hey guys, Darkside LEGO Studios here with my new mic, and today I'm going to show you how to make a ghost in GIMP. I'll also... <sighs> so the first thing you're going to do is go to File, Open, and open the picture that has just the background. Once you've done that, you're going to go to File, Open as Layers, and open the picture that has the thing you want to turn into a ghost. In this case, Ben Kenobi. And next, you're going to go to Control l and you're going to change the opacity to around 50. Now the other thing you might want to do is turn the ghost a little bit blue because that's how it looks like in the Star Wars films. So to do that, you're going to have to use the free select tool and you're going to select around the outside of Ben Kenobi. But I'm not going to make you watch that whole thing because that would be incredibly boring. It's taken so long to free select Ben Kenobi. Oh my gosh, I'm done. Yay! Okay, so once you have Ben Kenobi free selected, you're going to click on the pencil tool here. You're going to select a shade of blue that's around this one. Um, you can look at the letters 0073CB. And uh, then you're going to make the opacity of this pencil around 15 or so. You're going to make the size as big as it can be. Actually, I'm going to make the opacity a little bit bigger. 30. So now we're just coloring him in. He's free selected and therefore the pencil won't spill over. It's like color me mine. Okay, so Ben Kenobi has been adequately colored. Uh, if you followed all of these steps, it should look a little something like this. Boo!